Hello everyone, welcome back. Today is Sunday. I'm going to take you along with getting ready for the week and see what we have in store. We just got back from church and um, I have a few things that we're going to do today. We're going to watch a movie. I think I'm going to try to make some jelly, got laundry to do. I might try to exercise. I think I still need to run to the store. I don't know how much reset we're getting done, but we are getting stuff, I guess, done for the week that needs to get done that I guess I wouldn't have time to do during the week. So we just finished the movie If Imaginary Friend. I didn't know what that stood for. Um, but it was I really enjoyed it. It was a good family movie. Um, did you like it, Lorenzo? Yes. Yeah, it was a pretty good movie. So now we, me and just Lorenzo, are headed to Publix. Some um, mayonnaise, Duke's mayonnaise is on sale right now. Buy one, get one free. And normally at Aldi they're like four bucks and a Publix are five, but you're gonna get two for five. And then when I was at Aldi yesterday, I bought salmon for dinner. And as I'm sitting there thinking about what we're gonna eat for dinner, I was like, oh, salmon BLT sounds really good. Um, but I only have like sandwich bread and I didn't make any bread today or anything like that. So I figured I would get some rolls or some type of bread or BLTs and then I think we're gonna need a thing of creamer for the week so we'll pick that up while we are at Publix. So that's what Lando and I are going to do right now and it's raining. You can probably hear it, you can probably see it. It is definitely raining out right now. Okay so we're looking for rolls and well ciabatta here. They only got four, and that's all they have is four. I could go Kaiser. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do here, and my battery's dying. Okay, fast. I bought the four ciabatta rolls. That's all they have. I figure probably Luciano won't eat a sandwich anyway, so it'll work out. Got mango lemonade that um, I only find at Publix, and I love. I bought. Four mayonnaises and a thing of creamer. Probably what I saved on mayonnaise I spent on creamer. Okay, so now I am making something I've never made before. I'm making jelly and I'm using this Pindo Palms. I've never heard of them before either, but I have a tree in my front yard that drops them and dropped them all. So um, people online say it's really good. So I figured I would just do one batch and see if we really liked it. It really wasn't going to be that much effort or money to see if we liked it. So we made the juice um, earlier this week and then we had to chill it and strain it. And so here it is, it's gotta come to a rapid boil and inside of here it has pectin and the juice. So this is like five and a half cups of juice, I believe. And then what is so crazy is I have to add seven and a half cups of sugar to this juice and then add it rapidly and then pour it into these canning jars. So we're gonna try it. Wish me luck. Okay, so all my sugar is poured in now, and now I just need to let this come to a rolling boil for a minute and 15 seconds, stirring consistently. jam it just came out my jelly and I heard it pop I think I heard all five of them pop 
right after I took them out. So that's really exciting. And we got dinner going here. We're having salmon BLTs. I was cooking my salmon in my air fryer here and cooking my, I lied, I was cooking my bacon in my air fryer here and I was cooking my salmon in my air fryer here. And I would not have thought that this breaker and that breaker are on the same breaker and it blew a fuse. So then I had to finish cooking my bacon in the microwave. That's so weird though that I can run my microwave and that air fryer. I don't know. I don't Bread understand fryer. electricity. Bread's hot. Be careful with it, right? So, funny story, you probably already saw the video, I was like, hey, I'm walking on this treadmill, let's make a video of me doing it because, I don't know, I feel like I didn't have enough content or something from today. So, I didn't shut it off, and it was going two miles an hour, not that fast, but I didn't shut it off when I was like, oh, let me get my phone <laughs> set up. So I get it set up, and I say, oh, I'm just going to pop right back in. <laughs> <laughs> no. And then I couldn't just stop. I was just going into the closet and I couldn't keep going. That's it. Mm -hmm. And so now you can't even see the display to know how fast you're going because I totally broke it when I fell on it. I mean, the treadmill still works, but there's no distance or time or anything like that. And it's this dumb watch that I got. Um, someone sent it to me for a study that I am participating in, and it's supposed to motivate me to exercise. Well, it did, but you saw where it got me, right? Right through the closet door. <laughs> Too bad the camera wasn't like, I don't know, at a different angle and you could have seen the whole thing, but yeah, that's it. I just fell into the closet. Uh, I'm gonna shut this off now to stop this camera. Okay, so I just got off the treadmill and I'm so sore and twisted up. Um, but I made these energy bites. I used this base recipe, the five ingredients. And then I just added chocolate chips to them instead of like going through it specifically. And then this is what they look like. This is how many I get. I use a little cookie scoop. Scoop it out. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. So we got like 20 here and we're just gonna stick them in the fridge, let them get hard. And then um, everyone really likes these and something super fast to make. <laughs> 